Hi guys and welcome back to another vlog. Today I am gonna take you on a study ride with me, study with me kind of vlog. So for all of you who know and for all of you who do not know, I am planning to give my CFA level 3 exam in August. This is not my first attempt so there are a lot of negative emotions attached to it anyways. But point being, I have been struggling to study for it because somewhere managing work and studies is not going well with me. When I get free time, milta hai, then I just want to rest or chill. Sabbas, which I think a lot of us do also. I feel that in generation mein padna is like the toughest thing because we have a million distractions. Instagram being the major one. So yeah, point being, I have not started so much study yet. Definitely, I have completed the syllabus more than once. So I do have like one base because it's not my first attempt i've said it but padhai to karni padegi because in cfa what happens is no matter what you do it's not that you're gonna retain everything for so many months you need a certain level of revision so that's what i want to do and today i'm gonna be studying asset allocation the second chapter of it which is principles of asset allocation now i have a certain method of studying and i get very uncomfortable if that method is not followed like if i step then i feel like mm. And that makes me really, really underconfident. So the steps basically include number one, watching my uh, coach Manish Ramaka's video lectures. He takes live lectures as well, but since I've already attended it once, I watch the video lectures, the recorded lectures. So I watch an entire batch of that. While watching it, I make notes of my own, explain things to myself in my own language. I also copy some things that I feel are very, very important. But notes making is very, very essential. Step number two. Step number three. Once I finish these two steps, I have to also read through the entire Schwerzer chapter. Even if I've already kind of skimmed through it while uh, going through the video lectures, I have to read it once completely as solely. So that's step number three. Step number four, I need to solve all the blue box questions inside Schwerzer. Level three may usually come out, but jitne bhi hai, I need to do that. Step number five, I have to solve the end of chapter questions of Schwerzer. Again, itne nahi hote, but jitne bhi hote, I have to do and step number six, I need to solve the end of chapter curriculum questions. So if any of these steps are incomplete, it makes me very, very anxious. Aap kuch bhi bolo, ye nahi sunne wala. Right? Now, mostly sare subjects ke, uh, notes wagera are complete. But asset allocation, the subject I'm going to study today, the second chapter of it, uska notes are not very complete. Iske teen chapters hai basically. First one I finished already. Thank God kuch to kiya hai. But second wale and third wale ke notes are not very well done. So it takes me time. So that's what we're going to do. And itni bak bak nikatu, chizi dikha bhi letu and start kar letu. Also comment section mein please wish me all the best and tell me how are you guys studying? Are you also struggling with distractions, with work? With what? Let me know in the comment section. So for this chapter, that is principle of asset allocation, we have one, two, three, four videos and one we solved the questions in class which is great. So the first video is around 48 minutes, the second video is around 14 minutes, third one is around 41 minutes and last one is 25 minutes. Now because I am making notes like this, yes I am very finicky about how my notes are even though my handwriting sucks, but I need it to be as neat as possible. So since I'm making notes, all this time will actually become double because I need to keep pausing it to make notes. Oh God, pray for me. And then, as I said, I immediately sat down and read. Obviously, I had to open the time to do the vlog at the start and I always keep my hair open and all that jazz. But honestly, as you can see, I almost did not care. In fact, I really did not care because at the time of I need my hair up. And as I was showing in reality, you'll see me even in my worst state. Anyways, abhi hue the, raat ke 2.20, I literally started at 2.19 to be very precise. I know it was very late, ho gaya tha, but aaj mujhe tha ki bas, mujhe start karna hi hai, chahe kuch ho jai. Matab, bo hoti hai na, ek andar ki zid. I was very sure ki mein sirf 3 baje tak karungi, even if it was 40 minutes, but mainne ka nahi. Start to karna hi hai, and bas, aaj ka bahi goal tha, jo ho chuka hai pura. Honestly, Tuesday tha, I could have started earlier, it was my fault, but jaise ki mainne kaha, and I was just resting and chilling. I don't know why. Guilty. Let me know in the comment section.
this is one thing now that I've never spoken about. I think I've forgotten, but it is so important in the end back side of every subject book. Now, I make subject ke liye important points karke ek cheez banati hu, wherein I basically collate all the formulas or important points of only that subject. It is such a helpful thing in your exam day. Now, if you have not it, then definitely do try it. It is a game changer, believe me. Guys, I have just stop now at three two minutes it was around three four so i stopped studying i completed a little bit more than this actually oh uh, yeah i completed around 13.45 seconds sorry 13.45 minutes of my class and when i made notes i always say note taking is very very essential so around three pages wo piche wala include karke notes banaye yeah now i'm gonna go and sleep i know i should have started earlier it is my guilt and headphones i know i should have started earlier it is my guilt but like i said i just wanted to start a say even though i was tired i was like no aaj to hum karenge start karna important hai we'll see where we go uh the goal is definitely ki is hafte mein chapter finish karna thoda sa lengthy hai uh, with work Wednesday is honestly gonna be the toughest day Thursday Friday ho jayega but kal thoda doubt I will see kal kya aaj ho gaya we'll see and in case you're wondering where am I I'm at my hall mein bed my dining table pe padhe because room mein Amisha soi hai and it's our rule after 12 o'clock jisko jo kaam hota hai bhaar kata and the room is reserved for the person who wants to sleep or just doesn't want the light also for that matter and I'm going for today to do Nini भाई सब अब नींद जनवन दे आ रही है आल्सो सुबह मुझे उठना है ड्राइविंग क्लास है मेरी इफ यू गाइस वॉच माय डेली ब्लॉग्स यू विल नो कि मैं ड्राइविंग सीख रही हूं बीच-बीच में पता नहीं क्या आई डोंट नो व्हाई आई एम ट्राइंग टू डू सो मेनी थिंग्स इन लाइफ इट इज एक्चुअली लीडिंग मी टू मोर मेस देन आई एवर कैन गेट इनटू बट अब जो है सो है विल लर्न विल फिगर आउट अबे आई विल पैक एवरीथिंग because I just want to show you the kacha if it's fair to call this kacha because it's not over there but I really really make a mess I'm going to put it all there too or dining table or study table not very bad oh and in case you guys don't know I always have a ball because I'm too short and I want my foot to reach the ground so this ball is with me with 12 standards 11th actually अब जब इतना दिखा ही दिया है तो आई थॉट टू शो यू माय नोटबुक आल्सो दिस इज नॉट माय ओनली नोटबुक बट नेहा गॉट दिस एंड आई लव इसमें क्या लिखा है माय ब्रेन हैज टू मेनी टैब्स ओपन सो ट्रू सो फॉर सीएफए आई प्रेफर यूजिंग अ मल्टी सब्जेक्ट बुक आई डोंट आई थिंक इट्स जस्ट लाइक वेरी एफिशिएंट आप एग्जाम डे पे भी उठाना ही जीरो जाता है थोड़ा हैवी है बट इट्स रियली वर्थ इट हाय गाइस सो टुडे इज वेंसडे पढ़ाई मैंने अब तक की नहीं इट्स रेडी इवनिंग इट्स बीन अ स्लाइटली बिजी डे आई हैड टू गो आउट फॉर लंच इट वॉज अ फैमिली थिंग इट वॉज समथिंग प्री प्लान and for some reason मुझे इतनी ज़्यादा सर्दी हो गई I don't know if you can hear me actually सर्दी इज़ अ बहाना आई डोंट नो वाई सिंस द लास्ट टेन ट्वेल्व डेज आई बीन फीलिंग सो टायर्ड सो लथार्जिक मतलब आई एम जस्ट डूइंग द बेयर मिनिमम एंड आई एम लाइक बस मैं बहुत थक गया फील लाइक लिटरली हंसा वैन फ्राम खिचड़ी की मैं तो थक गई भाई साहब एंड पता नहीं क्यों हुआ है बट बहुत ही ज़्यादा थकान हो रही है लाइक आई एम काइंड ऑफ making bahanas to go even for my dance class which I never do I mean I am so tired and I don't know why I'll see I had to visit my homopathic doctor so I will do one second so anyways I don't want to talk about it because I feel like this sounds like a bahana and I don't want to sound like a bahana but it's happening so I haven't studied yet and anyways today is Wednesday so when I came here I did take a half an hour nap because I'm going to get my nap and now we are editing the podcast with Murad Vaik. We've uploaded the first part. If you've not seen it, please go check it out. And dekhte hain padhai. I hope I will do something. I don't want to not do anything today. So fingers crossed. Kitna khatam hota hai, but karna to hai yaar. Like this week, I want to finish the second chapter and start the third also. And mainly, if I'm doing all the six steps that I mentioned in the start, it's a little bit difficult because I'm a very very slow. लर्निंग मतलब मेरा ना ये है कि अगर मुझे एक लाइन भी नहीं समझाना देन आई कैन नॉट गो फॉरवर्ड आई नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड इट और तो मुझे आता है बट कभी कभी क्या होता है ना यू जोन आउट इन बिटवीन तो वैसा वाला सिचुएशन हो रहा है ज़्यादा ही बात कर रही हूँ आई थिंक सो एनी वेज आई गो नाउ आई फिनिश दी एडिटिंग आई शो यू ऑल्सो दैट एम हाउ एम एडिटिंग दिस एंड या आई सी यू इन अ बिट
this is the glimpse of the podcast it's out and believe me you do not want to miss it so guys it's wednesday today mujhe pata hi tha ki aaj fry karne ke chances thode se kam honge main kafi zid mein baithi thi ki main karungi karungi but honestly my body is just given up aaj main pata nahi ki bahut zyada thak gayi hu i don't know i think it was kal jagne ke wajah se and general like i said tab bhi theek nahi hui to maybe wo hoga pata nahi kya hai padhai to nahi hui like i'm crashing actually main thoda soi gayi thi but i got up and then i changed and then i realized ki update bhi dal deti hu and i think this is what happens you know when you're working also in week days pe it just genuinely becomes very very difficult aapko pata hoga jin din halke hote hain bas us din thoda bahut ho gaya to ho gaya on the other days honestly it's a gamble and that's why i keep telling people that if you're working and giving an exam make sure it's a longer time frame because you will require that time uh oh. I am definitely going to show you in total मुझे ये चैप्टर ख़त्म करने में कितना टाइम लगा एज अ वर्किंग प्रोफेशनल मे बी इस ब्लॉग में ख़त्म होता है कि नहीं आई डोंट नो बट नहीं तो अगले ब्लॉग में आ जाएगा बिकॉज दिस ब्लॉग इज सपोज टू कम आउट ऑन थर्स डे सो लेट सी आई डाउट खत्म होगा बट जितना भी खत्म होता है आई विल डेफिनेटली अब डेट आई विल शो यू एंड लाइक आई सेट इफ इट डजेंट गेट ओवर तो मैं पार्ट टू भी दिखाऊंगी बट पहले मैंने सोचा कि अगर कम्प्लीट नहीं हुआ तो नहीं दिखाऊंगी बट आई एम लाइक यू नो वॉट नो This vlog is about being honest. It's about the vulnerability. This is why I'm in such a bad mood. Because this is life, y'all. If I'm very beautiful, and I'm very beautiful, I'm very beautiful. 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 I'm very Good night. And इसके बाद मेरी हालत काफ़ी ख़राब हो गई I think I got this allergic cold क्योंकि मेरे building के बाहर बहुत ज़्यादा ही construction हो रहा है खैर पूरे Bombay में हो रहा है but मैं उस time पर नीचे घूमे जा रही थी कल पता नहीं कुछ था नीचे मुझे walk करना था and I didn't have a mask so it has affected me because I'm severely allergic to dust but anyways like I promised you vlog ज़रूर पूरा होगा I will show you exactly मुझे कितना time लगा but हाँ अगर ये video पसंद आए then please like share comment and subscribe I'll see you very soon until then keep sparkling and definitely keep learning